Good day, grade 4. Welcome to our science class. For today's topic, body parts of plant and aquatic animals. There are animals that live in water, underground, and above the ground. Others live on land. The habitat where animals live greatly affects their survival. Land and aquatic animals have different body parts or structure that help them survive in their environment. Animals that live on land are called terrestrial animals. Can you repeat that? Terrestrial animals are animals that live on land. Some land animals live in grassland, forest, or even in our houses. Some burrow on rocks, sand, or caves. How do land animals survive in the environment? The land animals have different body parts that help them adapt to the land condition. Some animals are covered with fur to keep them warm, like dog and bear. Others are covered with feathers, like bird and chicken. Some have smooth skin for breathing like worms. And most body covering of animals are for protection. Animals have body parts for moving like legs for walking and wings for flying. Land animals have lungs for breathing. Animals that live in water are called aquatic animals. Can you repeat that? Aquatic animals. Animals that live in water are called aquatic animals. They have body structures that help them adapt to water. Fishes are covered with scales for protection. Their scales are smooth and slimy, arranged overlapping from head to tail. So, as the water slips smoothly as it moves forward. Fish also have gills for breathing underwater and fins and tails for swimming. Take a look at the parts of the fish. Fish has fin, gills, scales, and tail. The shrimp and lobster are covered with outside skeleton and also called exoskeleton while other animals like clams and mussels are covered with what very good with shells for our activity let's identify the following animals if it is a terrestrial animals or aquatic animals. Are you ready, kids? 
Okay, let's start for number one. Okay, the bear. It is a aquatic or terrestrial animal. Very good. This is a terrestrial animal. How about this one? The crab. Is the crab aquatic or terrestrial animal? Very good. This is a aquatic animal. Next one is Next one is our favorite monkey. The monkey is what? Aquatic animal or terrestrial animal? What is the answer? Okay, very good. This is a terrestrial animal. Next. This is a seahorse. Seahorse is, what is your answer? Great, this is an aquatic animal. Next, the goat is aquatic or terrestrial. This one is terrestrial animal. Very good, kids. 